Good day sa inyo mga quiz mga ate. So this is Frederick and Cheta again para magbigay sa inyo ng panibagong video at panibagong kalaman naman tungkol sa YouTube channel ninyo. Alright. Um, without any further ado, ang, ang topic natin for today is all about YouTube Shorts Fund. Yan, YouTube Shorts Fund. Before I proceed, kung bago ka sa channel ko, please don't forget to subscribe and... Uh, turn on the notification bell. So, without any further ado, let's now get started. Intro. Ano nga ba ang YouTube Shorts Fund? So, ang YouTube Shorts Fund, ano lang muna tayo, basic details lang tayo regarding YouTube Shorts Fund. Uh, bali si YouTube Shorts Fund, para siya si... TikTok lang na maggagawa ka ng video na maikli like dapat minimum ng 15 seconds to maximum of 60 seconds yung YouTube shorts mo kaya nga sinabing shorts kasi maikli lang siya so ayun nga um, ang maganda kay shorts fun kaya ako sinabing nag-start tayo sa shorts fun kasi ano ang um, kumikita ka dito So, si YouTube, kagawa ng short video sa ano, gano'n lang ka ekle and then kung napili yung channel mo, edi pasok ka dun sa ano, sa YouTube Shorts Fund. So, medyo malaki-laki din ang bigay ni YouTube Shorts Fund. Kasi, may iba, iba kung may kita ng ilang dollars dito, well, syempre, sa part na to, kahit hindi ka monetize, pwede kang kumita ng YouTube Shorts Fund. So, di ba, napakaganda. Kaso, hindi ko siya ginagawa kasi mas busy tayo para magbigay ng mga kaalaman tungkol sa YouTube channel ninyo. Siyempre, tulong-tulong naman tayo dito. YouTube Shorts Fund. Yeah. YouTube Shorts Fund, mga quiz mga ate, nakalagay dito. The YouTube Shorts Fund is a $100 million fund to reward creators for their dedication. Okay? to making creative original shorts that delight the YouTube community will reach out to thousands of creators each month to tell them that they qualify for the uh, a short bonus from the fund yeah medyo na ano pa tayo no utal utal pa tayo pero ay nga um simple lang natin yung explanation nito so sa si you know si YouTube shorts fund daw uh, may fund siya na like a hundred million dollars fund rewards sa mga creators na nagki-create ng mga shorts video para i-post sa ano yung like parang TikTok siya ganun and then kapag qualify ka doon manonotify ka i-reach out ka ni YouTube ino-notify ka na oh hey you are eligible for this ano fund so ipapaklaim na lang sila sa yan sa iyo yung kinita mo sabi diyan Uh, to be eligible for a bonus from the YouTube Shorts Fund, sabi, channels need to have uploaded at least one eligible short in the last 180 days. Anong gustong sabihin niyan, mga kuwis, mga ate? Dapat nakapag-upload ka na daw na kahit isang video na eligible sa, yung pang, pang YouTube Shorts in the last ano, 180 days, in the last 3 months, dapat may na-upload ka na na YouTube Shorts mo. Pangalawa, channels need to abide the, by YouTube's community copyright rules, monetization policies. And so, na-explain naman natin yung ano, um, community guidelines na yan. Um, pwede mo siyang i-check, I believe. Ay, strike basic sa pala yun. No? Pero, click mo na lang, ilalapag mo na lang siguro yung link nito ni YouTube Shorts Fund. Tapos, click nyo na lang siya para may may reference din kayo. Pwede nyo i-open yan para ma-review ninyo yung community guidelines. Um, next thing here, sabi dito, um, copyright rules. So, alam naman natin mga copyright rules. Pag hindi originally sa'yo yung um, video yun, di, hindi kami eligible. And then, yung summarization policies. Click, click, click nyo lang yung mga link na yan. So, so uh, next tayo, channels uploading videos with watermark or logos from third-party social media platforms, non-original videos, sample, for example, non-edited clips from movies or TV shows or... or videos we uploaded from other creators' channels will not be eligible. So, ngayon, pumapasok nyo yung copyright, mga kuwis, mga ate. So, pag hindi sa inyo, yung video nyo, 
may watermark, may logo, ganito, ganyan, ay ibig sabihin, hindi siya magiging eligible kasi hindi naman totally sa inyo yun. And next here, uh, creators must be 13 or older in the United States or the age of majority in the country or region. And so, depende sa region ninyo, kung ano yung, ano, uh, ano yung limit no, nun sa age, kung, kung kailang 13 or 18 years old ka para kumita yun nun, di, pwede ka na dito. Basta check mo lang yung link na bigay dyan yung, uh, wala namang check na, wala namang link pala, pero pwede nyo namang i-check yung country ninyo. And next tayo, sabi dyan, the creators 13 to 18 years old must have a parent or guardian, accept terms, and set up AdSense account for payment when one isn't already linked to their channel. So, kailangan may, may sabi, for payment when, and so, kailangan meron kang separate na AdSense account para makareceive ka ng um, payments from YouTube funds kapag ikaw ay ano, nasa 13 to 18 lang. Napakalaga niya kasi receiving ng ano yan eh ng payment din yan and next tayo creators must be in one of these countries or region sabi eh. sabi niya so, dito yung makikita yung mga eligible countries so check nyo lang isa-isa medyo madami yan hindi ko nababasahin isa-isa yan basta ito yung mga countries or regions na ano na pwedeng mag play or hindi naman pwede, pero eligible para, para sa YouTube Shorts Fan. So, napakasimple lang naman yung mga detailing yun. Yan, kasama Philippines, Taiwan, Thailand, yan. Kita nyo kita yan. So, channels do not need to be currently monetizing on YouTube to be eligible. Gaya nga sabi ko kanina, hindi mo kailangan may eligible para kumita ng YouTube Shorts Fan. Sabi dito, Creators in the YouTube Partner Program and channels that are affiliates under MCN are also available. So, or eligible pa available pa. Nice. Ayan, so, YPP ka man, nasa MCN ka man, or hindi ka man monetize na channel, pwede kang kumita nyo ito. Itong YouTube Shorts Fund na to. So, sabi dito, how do I qualify for the U Shorts Fund? Ayan, Ayan madami nagtatanong sa atin yung mga ganyan eh. Maraming napapaisip niya kung paano sila may eligible. So, sabi dyan, each month will tell thousands of shorts creators to claim a bonus from the shorts fund based on their channel's shorts performance in the previous month. So, kapag eligible ka ngayong buwan, or last month, manonotify ka ngayong buwan. A channel's shorts will count toward their monthly performance. Each month, viewers watch them, not just a month they were uploaded. So, nasa performance talaga yun, kaya hindi ma-verify if talagang eligible ka dun or hindi. Sabi dito, there's no specific performance threshold to qualify for a bonus. The level of performance needed to qualify for a bonus payment may change from month to month based on uh, various factors including the location of your viewers and the, lo the overall growth of shorts. YouTube channel's short performance is reviewed every month. If you don't qualify one month, you may qualify the next, sabi dito. So, again, wala siyang specific performance, pero sy syempre, still nagbibasic pa rin sila sa performance ng video mo, pero hindi lang yun yun. Hindi lang yun yun yung, yung ano, uh, chinecheck nila para maging qualified ka pa para sa YouTube shorts. So, madami silang titinin dyan. Actually, hindi ko din alam kung paano nila, ano, Pinapa, paano nila kinukombit yun pero once na eligible ka doon manunotify ka na lang next month si every month yung ano nun eh and then how will I know I know I qualify for the shorts fund ayan creators kaya nga sinabi ko manunotify kayo kapag ili, uh, eligible kayo to receive YouTube, YouTube shorts fund manunotify kayo both email, pati yung sa application nyo, manonotify kayo doon, alam ko doon. Ayan, ang YouTube app, after the first week of of each month. So, sabi, qualifying creators should get this notification soon after the first week of the month. Ayan, so they'll have until 25th of the, each month to claim their bonus. So, may time limit siya, mga quiz, mga So, pag hindi mo nakuha yon yung fund na yun, they 
wala na. Uh, naging charity na yun. So, sayang din. Kaya kailangan ma... Pag na-notify kayo doon, makuha nyo agad. How much can I get from short, the, from the shorts fund ang nakalagay dito between 100 to 10,000 each mga 10,000 dollars yung pwede mong makuha. Nag-adjust yun depende sa location ng location mo as a result ng ano na the viewership and engagement needed to qualify may differ between priority. So, nakadepende pa rin yan sa mga uh, sa kikitain mo dun sa viewers mo kung saan sila naka base or na, saan yung location nila so how do I claim my shorts bonus from the shorts fund so ito uh, pagka notify mo dun uh, qualifying creators can select claim bonus in the email pwede mo i-click yung claim bonus dun sa email mo or sa notification na na-receive mo sa application mo para makuha yung yung bonus mo so accept the bonus terms lang tapos set up yung set up or link an AdSense account pag wala ka pa. For channels with an active link AdSense account or those that receive payment from MCN or Network, your bonus will be claimed after this two steps down. You know. If you set up an AdSense account, it may take a few days for YouTube to create and link the AdSense account to your channel. Mga notify ka once yung account is linked na daw and confirm whether your bonus has been claimed or hindi pa. How do I get my shorts bonus from AdSense? Ayan. Uh, kung setting up ka lang na ano, sabi dito, claim, bon- uh, claim and get qualifying creators need to make sure an approved and active AdSense account is linked to their channel. If already have an AdSense account, you'll get your bonus payment with any other monthly YouTube earnings. Pag wala pa, pag wala pa kayong AdSense di follow nyo na lang to yung steps na to hindi ko na to iisa-isahin kasi para sa mga wala pang ano madalas sa atin may mga AdSense account na and lastly when will I get paid from the from the YouTube Shorts Fund sabi dito qualifying creators with a link AdSense account can expect to receive payments 4 to 6 weeks from the time they claim the bonus so Uh, to make it simple mga kuwis mga ate, if qualify ka and then na-claim mo na yung bonus mo, merong 4 to 6 weeks na ano, parang pa- bago ma-transfer yun sa ano, sa AdSense account mo. And once na-transfer na yan, sasabay yan sa, sa payment mo every, alam ko dyan, 21st to 26th of the month. Ayun na nga mga kuwis mga ate. If nakatulong or I hope nakatulong sa inyo ang video to, So, if you found this video informative, please do leave me a thumbs up. And if you have questions, clarifications, and suggestions, please comment down below. For more content like this, please subscribe and turn on the notification bell ulit. And that's all for today. See you sa next video ko. Bye!